Join me as we traverse the Wyvern Trench and take on the arduous task of harvesting 60 Wyvern Talons required for the Alpha Manticore Battle. All right, we're back. And uh, as you could realize from all this walking, we have a lot of Argent Davis in here. This is the breeding center. It's actually just connected to the villa. Uh, a small little hut of sorts. Don't want to get too crazy. Don't need a ton of room. But I did realize that, boy, male Argents can really reach across. These girls over here, they are breeding with him. And we have a little terminal from uh, SCS storage. I kind of like them, they're good. I do have two different dino storage mods. I got Dino Depot and I got these ones. SCS, they do the whole, you know, picking up stuff, incubating stuff. We just did a couple rounds of eggs. I don't remember how many females we have in here. Maybe, maybe an amount, doesn't matter. As long as we're making eggs. Um, I don't know if we're going to try to use like mutation potions on the males to guarantee mutations in all his babies. That sounds like that sounds like some sketchy shit. But um you know what? We'll we'll see how a couple of rounds go if we get um mutations. I think we might focus on health and melee because honestly, we need them to take a couple blows from the Manticore and they gotta start dealing that damage and they gotta do it fast. So, in this video, we are going to start collecting trophies. Um, I think I might have enough, but you know what? We're gonna go pick a um, obelisk to gather at and then we'll just kind of have a peek at like what do we need how much of it do we need we're gonna start with the alpha so we're probably gonna need a lot I don't really know <sighs> ah this is so great okay I was so happy because these are display cases and you can put your creatures in them and they will display them unfortunately they don't display the true colors on a lot of my guys it's kind of annoying but the SCS Super Crown Storage does work with these because they kind of, they're like a replication of the cryopods. Uh, Dino Depot does not work in these. I don't know if they plan on fixing that or even realize that's something, but hey, I don't really care. I got one that works. Here are two of my wyverns from, from the last video. They look really good on here. I love them. Dude, they do show their true colors. These guys are shinies, so I don't know what's up with that. Uh, I think he's like... This one's a light-colored one. Uh, it's like white and yellow. Uh, this guy's like a freaky, like, silvery color. Obviously, it's not showing. Whatever. Who cares? I don't care. It's probably in the buff from the shiny mod. Yeah, this one's still pretty cute. It's like blue and pink. Yeah, not too bad. There's some weather coming. We don't like that. Instead, instead of a uh, shoulder pet, I have a, a cacti. I can't even see it. Come on, can we zoom in? Yeah, we got a little cactus on our shoulders. Say hi to cactus. We need to give cactus a name at some point. But for now, we're gonna go and we're gonna select the location. I have no idea where. I don't think I've ever really been to Green Obelisk. Maybe? Let's go over there. Could be fun. Plus, there's a red drop. Gotta love the red drop. I was looking up how to breed an Arc Ascended. And it's basically the same. It's just how mutations and your stacks get pushed into the next babies is different, I guess. It's based on like the values and adding them together and stuff. I, uh, I'm I'm not patient enough to pay attention to stuff 
like that. <gasps> oh shit, we got a flamethrower. Oh my god, you stupid little dog. Don't laugh at me. Yeah, that's what you get. Now your child is a freaking orphan. Anyway, what was I doing? God damn, what the hell? Oh my god, there's so many! Get out of here! Because they have a baby, so they're all super aggressive. There it is. You! 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 I'm gonna get you, little ragamuffin. Throw one of these down. No particular reason. And then I'll drop the rest. Yeah! Let me get that little guy. Where are you at? No, you don't. I want that little guy! What the hell? <laughs> Baby hyena dog goes zipping away. It's crazy. No, oh, I don't want to deal with you! Frickin' snake. Okay, we lost it. I wanted to take my fiery vengeance upon it, but you know what? You live and you learn, I guess. Okay, are we good here? Is this good? I like how that it's pretty open. There might be Capra's around. Capra? I lost my hat. I'm very upset. Alright, let's look. Whew. Okay, wow, we need a lot. Oh my god, we need. <laughs> oh, we need. We just gotta. It's just the wyverns. We gotta fight the wyverns. Oh my days. So we need 20 of each. Wow. Yeah, I've never done Scorched Earth, so that's news to me. Hell. Gee. Well, I guess uh, we're gonna be going into the wyvern trench. Um, I think we need to make turrets. Because, damn, dealing with those guys? What? Hell. Okay, let's go home. Let's start making some turrets. Probably make a Jenny. Make a little building for the Jenny. Make a lot of bullets. I hate making bullets, bro. Oh my god. I hate it. But well, we're gonna have to do it. <laughs> Here's the moment where I got distracted because I actually ran into this max level scorched acro that was a shiny. And of course I had to put him in the trap. Wide fucking turns. Boom. You're in the fucking trap. I'm gonna tame your ass later, you mother... <laughs> okay, we're finally at the stage where... We're making some turrets. Let's see how many we can make. Please, please. We already have a generator. So we need three of these, and then we need to transform them into three of these. We only need three, honestly. A lot of... I mean, we might only need two. To be honest. But we'll see how many we can make. I didn't really count anything out. How much metal we're gonna need? Maybe we should just make two. Maybe just two. That's... A bit expensive with regard to metal and we'll definitely have enough electronics and polymer so yeah we'll just stick with two for now plus we yeah we, we we can't make a third one anyway okay we just got a pit stop we had plenty of metal there was more than enough and we could make the two turrets the heavy turrets pretty sure these will do just fine Beautiful. Amazing. Perfect. We love to see it. Alright, we got two heavy auto turrets. That should be more than enough. More than enough. Uh, now we just need to make bullets. I think we make these in the fabricator. What, <laughs> what am I doing? Like, oh my god, look at all this gunpowder. Like, whoa. 
put all this in here because we're gonna use it all hopefully it's enough to kill 60 wyverns how are we gonna get find 60 wyverns we're gonna be out there for a while um where's the bullets what kind of bullets do we use oh wow we don't yeah, huh i'm guessing it's advanced rifle right is that it put advanced rifle bullets why can't they just say that in all the other little things? Alright, we'll just work on that and make more bullets. And when I return, okay, we'll have a shirt on. Very important. But also, we will already be at the Wyvern Trench with everything set up. See you then. Ooh, ooh. Oh, look at him! <laughs> so, I made it to the Wyvern Trench. I set up my little, my little box. It had the Jenny inside. It had turrets on top. Fantastic. Put in the gas lane, put in the bullets. We're good to go. Except I was having this problem where I would get the wyverns. They would fall to the ground. But if they went into the mountain, they would literally clip into the mountain and the corpses just disappear. I cannot access them any longer. So we had to move it. I just moved on the other side of the trench out into the desert. <laughs> At least the... The, the wyvern bodies wouldn't flip into the desert, I hope. Anyway, that was that was the final destination for our turret trap.
All right. We finally did it. We have 20 of each one. I had to go back home because I did, I did take a break from this. Two different recordings. <laughs> but we finally got 20. It was less of a pain with the turrets. They really did make it mm, more efficient. We'll probably use these guys at some other point, but not right now, because we're done. We probably will need to come back when we want to do Gamma and Beta, but we won't need to get as many. We're doing the hardest part first. But for now, let's just go back home and check on the Argents from earlier. Let's go hatch some eggs. See if we can get any mutations from the old fashioned way and maybe we'll try out a mutation potion. Hopefully that doesn't ruin the bird, but if it does, we could always breed another one. It'll be fine. All right, we're finally here. Didn't take too long. <clears throat> Let's put these talons away. We don't need them right now. Where should I put them? I'll put them over here. All 20. And then, of course, we have our artifacts. Probably have to go get more at some point. Let's see. Oh, there's the door. All right, here are the birds. They've been sitting here this whole time. So patient, so forgiving. We have many eggs. Ah... Uh, I forgot that I have to hatch these. But I don't want to hatch them in here. Or do I? Hmm, I think the issue is I need to call them. If only we had something that we can put the eggs in and we can see their stats before they hatch. Ugh. Should I bring them in here? No, oh, I might have to. All right, I'm just gonna go grab these little eggios. Kind of tedious. I might have to make a more efficient methodology of this. Oh, they're so small! Look at them. They're beautiful. I see a 270 in there. Actually, I see two of them. They could be twins, but I don't want these other ones. Okay, hold on. Oh, I almost had the 270. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Can I get the other one? Oh, yeah. Okay, can you guys follow me over here? Is that cool? I need to give him a little poke of encouragement, you know what I'm saying? Oh my god. That it hits it. Okay. Babies. You're so tiny and cute. Let's see what your uh, mutation is. Wait. And yours is stamina. Mutations we do not need, unfortunately. Alright, here's another batch. Two a little bit at a time. Alright, alright. Oh, look like they're all two six eights. Which is a shame because they're all very pretty. 
All right, got another batch. This is the last batch for the regular eggs. Unfortunately, I do not see any 270s, which would have been a mutation. Alright, we'll just use Ren so I don't bust up the floor again because I just finished fixing everything. Let's go make a potion. An itty bitty potion. I think we need five of these and then we need do we have stone in here oh we probably do i just walked by the the doid and then we're gonna go in our crafting there is consumables for some reason because i have modded stuff it's in vegetables so apparently these are vegetables um we need the mutation elixir Okay, so you feed this to a dinosaur and all their babies will guarantee they get mutations, which is hukka crazy. Alright, so we're going to feed this to our male. Because our male will have the mutation to give to all the babies. Uh, this is boy, right? Yeah. Okay. Alright, little Argentavis, don't let me down. I'm going to take these last few so they don't get mixed up and we are going to uh, enable meeting. Are they mating? They're mating. You mating too? You guys are mating? Okay, cool. I'll be back later. Let's go hatch these little guys real quick. Maybe we'll have a tiny little miracle here. Wow, there's a triplet. And unfortunately there are none, so sad. I think we don't need any more, to be honest. Just, just an idea. That's more than enough. We'll come back when these eggs are incubated and ready to be hatched. All right, these babies are ready to hatch. Let's get a good stack. All right, it's gonna be a, a slow little walk back. <laughs> All right, let's see if these guys are born with mutations or not. Nah. Still had birds born at two six eight. What is up with that? Yo. Yep. I guess that's a bust because none of these little guys came out with any form of mutation. Yeah. Do I have to give it to the female? Cause that could like. Make things more difficult. And I don't really want to do that. I kind of want to keep the females clean. The whole point is to have the males move their uh, mutations forward and create them. 
Ugh, so frustrating. Okay, let's see if there's anything weird about that. No, well, apparently not. Yeah, I think whatever that potion is, it's broken. And you know what? We might look at something else, but we'll just keep doing it the old-fashioned way. Unfortunately, all these babies do not have any. I don't have a single mutation. Well, that's all for now. We'll just keep mutating birds. I want to at least get a handful of mutations. We don't want to get too crazy. And then I guess we'll do the manticore fight. Keep in mind that for the gamma and the beta, I may put up a poll in have viewers decide what type of team out of those I offer to fight the other Manticore battles. Anyway, see you later. <laughs>